day four here this morning. It's a little spring down here. We're gonna go check and see if we can pick up some tracks to find some tracks to get going this morning. But we'll see how it goes. Johnny and his trackers discussed the plan of action for the elephant hunt. They decided that the tracks were worth following. So they began their stalk. Congratulations, Keith. Congratulations. <laughs> that was an awesome brain shot. Well done. <laughs> That's my elephant. <laughs> but the main thing was that was an awesome brain shot. It was about 18 paces. Is that what it was? That yeah. Close? Yeah. You just cut it in the middle, you hold the end and cut it off. The old, the, the old hunt, elephant hunters used to do that to claim the elephant. Zambezi Valley, Zimbabwe! Where's that? Zambezi Hunters! <laughs> Okay, it's Tuesday morning, September 4, about 10.30 in the morning. We're sitting here with my dead bull elephant, uh, hunting here in the Zambezi Valley with Johnny Hume with Zambezi Hunters. We left camp on day 4, about 5.30 this morning. It's up early every morning and, and start driving, looking for tracks. And today we decided to go to this spring, a water hole where the elephants come to drink during the night and hoping we would be able to catch a, a fresh track and they, I don't know, it was about nine o'clock we pulled up there and they they were able to pick up a fresh track so that was an exciting part on the, on the of hunting and we started trailing it tracking it with the trackers and we didn't realize it would it was that close we saw where it had laid down and we continued on it was kind of hard because it's windy the tracks were getting kind of blown over, but not an hour later we, we, we saw him and it took us a while to determine whether to shoot him or not. He's not a, a huge one, but he's about a 30 pounder, uh, but time is short on this hunt. We have to get over to the Save Valley. So we decided to take the shot and we got into position and Johnny kind of guided me where to stand, where to shoot, and I had a good look at him and, and made a pretty good shot and he dropped with a, with a perfect brain shot. Johnny, what do you have to say? Yeah, well, this has been quite an interesting hunt. We 
Um, I think this is our fourth day of elephant hunting here in uh, Chiwori North, Sambizi Valley. Um, we've seen a lot of elephant, but uh, all cows and a couple of young bulls. We just haven't seen any big bulls. Um, and this hunt is a, you know, Keith wants to get down and join his sons on the Savi, so we've been working pretty hard at the elephant to try and get it down and looking for big tracks. Anyway, Keith told the story about how he got in here and got the tracks and that, but um, he's, he's a really nice elephant, uh, long ivory, which is always, always looks good. Um, not that thick, but nice and long. He's got over two and a half feet sticking out. Um, and we had a really exciting hunt, got in close. We looked at him for a long time. The wind was in our favor, which was awesome. And Keith took a frontal brain shot, perfect brain shot. He brained him. Perfect shot. Yeah, perfect shot. Absolutely perfect shot. Couldn't have been better. Um, the first time Keith lined up, you couldn't see the eyes um, of the elephant because it was behind a bush. So we had to move him a few feet to the right. And then there, there's so many leaves here, dried leaves at this time of year. It's almost like walking on cornflakes. When he took a step, the elephant heard us and he sort of, sort of stopped. Then he relaxed again and we waited for him. And then Keith got into position. He took an offhand shot, 17 yards and gave him a frontal brain shot. He went straight down. We came around the side and just gave him two insurance shots. Uh, they weren't necessary, but they were always good to do on these big animals. And um, that was the end of a good elephant hunt. And now we're off to the Savi. We've had an exciting hunt. Uh, last night coming back through the river valley, we saw two lionesses, got real close to them, got good video of them. We saw a couple of herds of buffalo. We saw a lot of game yesterday. It was really an exciting day.